deadly house fire in Winter Haven. While you were sleeping, flames raced through this home on Timberline Road, killing a woman. And that's where we find Avery Cotton. Avery, what can you tell us about the fire? Do we know who the victim was yet? Well, good morning to you, Beth. I'll tell you, this is such a sad story. We know nine people were inside this home when that fire started around midnight. There were seven kids, a mother, and that mother's friend. And this morning, we know that it was the mother's friend, a 53-year-old woman who did not make it out of this house and has passed away. I'll step out of the way so you can see the home we're talking about on Timberline Road. For reference, we're about two miles from the sheriff's office in Winter Haven. Polk Fire PAO Chris Jonkier tells me that a mother and her seven kids were inside along with that mother's friend that I mentioned. The fire started in the friend's bedroom. While the mom was able to get the kids out, her friend was not able to get out herself and did not make it. Family and friends right now are gathered outside of the home and neighbors tell us that the woman who passed was a very nice woman. They've hung out with her before as well as those seven kids. And while the fire did start in the bedroom, the cause right now being investigated, there are still some investigators on scene right now. As soon as we learn more about that though, we'll be certain to pass that along to you. But again, a very sad story out here as we continue to hear family and friends come up on scene crying when they hear the news and uh, Marco our thoughts are certainly with that woman's family yeah so sad to hear this was a full house and now it's an empty house along with uh, bleeding you know crying hearts over this all right thank you so much Avery well this morning I'm